Picture yourself on a tranquil shoreline as twilight settles in, the sky awash with the last colors of day. You send a message sealed in a bottle out into the vast, mysterious sea, hoping that somewhere far beyond your sight, it might one day be discovered. Voyager 1 is humanity's own cosmic message in a bottle, launched into the endless expanse of space, carrying our hopes and questions into the great unknown. Sent into the stars by NASA in 1977, this car-sized probe was built to explore Jupiter and Saturn, revealing sights and secrets never before seen, and then to journey even farther, beyond the very edge of our solar system. Voyager 1 became our distant eyes and ears, a symbol of human curiosity and ambition, embodying our endless urge to reach out and understand the universe. It carries more than just scientific tools, it holds the dreams, greetings and hopes of all humanity, etched onto a golden record for any who might one day find it. Fueled by plutonium, equipped with cameras, sensors and a powerful antenna always aimed at Earth, Voyager 1 is a triumph of engineering, built to survive for decades in the harshest reaches of space. Alongside its twin, Voyager 2, it seized a rare planetary alignment, using gravity assists to slingshot from world to world, saving time, conserving fuel, and making an impossible journey reality. This grand tour was a race against the clock, a breathtaking voyage across billions of kilometers, pushing the limits of exploration and human achievement. Voyager 1's odyssey marks humanity's first step into the galaxy, a shining example of what we can accomplish when we dare to dream, explore, and reach for the stars. September 5, 1977, a date that would echo through history. Voyager 1 thundered skyward atop a Titan rocket, its engines blazing and the Florida sky ablaze with light and anticipation. In a dazzling display of power and hope, Voyager 1 left our planet behind, carrying humanity's boldest ambitions to explore the mysteries beyond our world. Once adrift in the cosmic sea, Voyager set its sights on Jupiter, quietly gathering data on solar winds and cosmic rays, and sending back discoveries from distances never before reached by any spacecraft. Back on Earth, mission control was a hive of nerves and excitement. Scientists watched every signal, their eyes glued to screens as Voyager's antenna stayed locked on home, awaiting its first planetary encounter. Ahead loomed Jupiter, a colossal world and the proving ground for the gravity assist maneuver. This daring slingshot would hurl Voyager deeper into the solar system than ever before. The mission demanded patience and pinpoint accuracy. With every mile Voyager traveled, radio signals took longer to cross the growing gulf between Earth and the tiny probe. By the time Voyager neared Jupiter, each command was a slow-motion conversation. Hours would pass before instructions reached the spacecraft, and even longer for a reply. The team would send their commands, then wait in suspense, hoping for a sign from their far-flung explorer. Every action was measured, every moment a step into uncharted territory, as Voyager pushed farther than any human creation had ever dared. The Grand Tour was underway, a journey that would forever transform our understanding of the solar system. When Voyager 1 arrived at Jupiter in March 1979, it revolutionized our understanding of the gas giant. Until then, Jupiter was just a blurry speck in the night sky, barely more than a smudge through Earth's telescopes. But Voyager's close encounter replaced those indistinct images with jaw-dropping high-definition portraits unveiling a planet far more active and mysterious than anyone had dreamed. Suddenly, we could see the Great Red Spot's furious storm up close, along with Jupiter's swirling cloud bands and a world teeming with wild, ever-changing weather. The sheer size and intensity of these storms were unlike anything we'd ever witnessed on our own planet. But Jupiter's moons delivered the biggest surprises. Io amazed scientists with its explosive volcanoes, erupting for the first time ever seen beyond Earth hurling molten rock into space. Meanwhile, Europa's fractured icy shell hinted at a hidden ocean below, sparking hopes that life might exist in its shadowy depths. With its mission at Jupiter complete, Voyager used the planet's gravity as a cosmic slingshot, racing toward Saturn and arriving in 1980 for another historic encounter. Saturn's rings, once thought to be simple and smooth, turned out to be a dazzling maze of thousands of ringlets, each shaped by tiny shepherd moons weaving through the debris and carving out intricate patterns and gaps. Voyager's instruments also investigated Titan, Saturn's largest moon, and found its thick orange atmosphere was packed with nitrogen and methane, creating an alien world unlike anything else in our solar system. 
Although Voyager's cameras couldn't see through Titan's dense haze, the enigmatic world beneath its clouds became a source of fascination, inspiring decades of scientific curiosity and future missions. Each flyby of these giant planets shattered old ideas and revealed astonishing new mysteries transforming our understanding of the outer solar system. Voyager's bold journey paved the way for future exploration, igniting the imagination of scientists and opening up a universe of questions for generations to come. And so, Voyager pressed on, venturing farther into the cosmic unknown, carrying humanity's curiosity to the very edge of the solar system and beyond. Fastened to Voyager 1 is the Golden Record, a shimmering 12-inch gold-plated disc, carrying humanity's greeting to the universe. Handpicked by Carl Sagan and his team, it's packed with 115 images, the sounds of our planet, greetings in 55 languages, and music ranging from Bach to Chuck Berry. The record is a showcase of Earth's diversity and imagination, from joyful laughter to haunting whale songs. Its cover acts as a cosmic instruction manual, etched with diagrams explaining how to play it, and where Voyager began its journey. A pulsar map on the cover reveals our location in the galaxy, a beacon for any curious finder. The golden record stands as a message of peace and hope, a symbol of our longing to reach out across the stars. It's our interstellar time capsule, silently journeying through the endless expanse of space. After its encounter with Saturn, Voyager 1's mission took on a bold new purpose, pushing toward the very edge of our solar system. In 1990 Voyager turned its camera homeward, capturing the iconic pale blue dot, Earth, a mere speck in the endless dark. Its new quest, to reach the heliopause, the invisible frontier where the sun's reach fades and interstellar space begins. For years, Voyager braved the chaotic heliosheath, its instruments on high alert for any sign of the boundary. Then in August 2012, everything changed, solar particles plummeted while cosmic rays spiked. Voyager 1 had done it, it crossed into interstellar space becoming the first human-made object to leave our solar bubble. It was a milestone for humanity, after 35 years our robotic envoy had reached the farthest shores of the cosmic ocean. With Voyager, humanity had finally brushed the stars, if only through the eyes of a machine. For years, Voyager 1 cruised through the void, faithfully sending home streams of data from beyond our solar system. Until, suddenly, in late 2023, its messages became nothing but incomprehensible static. NASA's brightest minds rushed to unravel the mystery, quickly zeroing in on the Flight Data Subsystem, or FDS, as the likely culprit. They fired off command after command, but Voyager kept replying in nonsense, still speaking, but its words were lost. The world watched in suspense. Was this the final chapter for Voyager, or was something even stranger unfolding? Digging deeper, the team discovered a corrupted memory chip inside the FDS, the very part that organizes Voyager's data. The real challenge? Repairing a computer nearly 24 billion kilometers away, where every command takes almost two days to get a reply. Scouring through decades-old manuals and blueprints, the engineers hunted for answers buried in history. It became a true test of creativity, determination, and the relentless spirit of exploration. In the spring of 2024, NASA's team took a daring step. They decided to reroute Voyager's data, bypassing the failed memory chip. They sent a carefully crafted command and held their breath, waiting for Voyager's response from the edge of the solar system. The reply revealed a telltale repeating pattern, clear evidence that the memory chip was truly compromised. Their fix? Break the software into pieces and tuck each part into undamaged memory, a high-stakes remote brain surgery for a spacecraft billions of miles away. By April the first software patch worked, Voyager sent back a strong, clear signal about its condition, and by May, its science instruments were alive again, streaming precious data from the vastness of interstellar space. That final message wasn't a farewell, it was a challenge, cracked by the creativity and persistence of the team. Voyager's endurance and the unwavering commitment of its caretakers pulled it back from the edge. Decades later, our cosmic messenger still has new stories to share. Voyager 1 presses onward, silently slicing through the darkness at more than 61,000 kilometers per hour. Its energy is dwindling. By 2036, its voice will fade, and its instruments will go dark forever. 
Still, Voyager 1 will wander the galaxy for millions of years, carrying humanity's message into the unknown. Its epic voyage proves that we can reach beyond our home, sending a fragment of ourselves into the cosmic sea. In 40,000 years, it will glide past another star, its odds of discovery are tiny, but never zero. The golden record endures, a hopeful greeting, waiting for anyone, or anything that might hear it. So next time you look up at the stars, think of Voyager 1, our small, courageous explorer still journeying between worlds. Its odyssey reminds us to keep wondering, keep searching, and never stop dreaming.